Hello, and welcome to a virtual tour of some of the exciting changes coming to Central Middle School over the next couple of years. One of the goals of the renovation are interior finish improvements throughout the school. Corridors and classrooms will receive finish upgrades, including new paint, carpet, ceilings, and LED lighting. The other main goal is to create learning hubs throughout the classroom wing. There will be learning hubs dedicated to each of the four houses that we'll be seeing shortly, and there's one learning hub at the center of the building called the Ranger Core, which we'll be visiting first. The Ranger Core is the heart of Central Middle School. It will be the first space you come to as you enter the academic wing from the main office. You will immediately notice an extra wide corridor that leads into a new, bright, welcoming space. Let's take a closer look. Looking back toward the main office from where we just came, you will immediately notice high ceilings, windows letting in plenty of natural light, and windows on either side of the corridor that look into two new spaces that are part of the Ranger Core. On the left is the collaboratory, and on the right is a Ranger presentation room, which we'll head to first. The Ranger presentation room is a large open space with tall ceilings and high windows on one side to let in lots of natural light, which is a consistent theme you'll see throughout the renovated spaces on this tour. The flexible nature of the room allows it to be quickly rearranged depending on the day's activity, and on the wall opposite the Ranger core, you'll see a large screen for presentations from one of the 7th or 8th grade houses. As we pan back around toward the Ranger core, we'll see the next space on our tour, the Collaboratory. The name collaboratory is derived from two words, collaboration and laboratory, and is meant to be a hands-on space for creative exploration. Some of the main features are concrete floors, LED lighting, and a large garage door that leads directly outside to the adjacent courtyard. Not only does it let in natural light, but it allows the creative work to continue out of doors. The next place we're going to visit is one of the four learning hubs that will reside in each of the 7th and 8th grade houses. It will serve two major functions. The first is a breakout space to allow for a variety of collaborative efforts. And second, you'll notice windows that open into the main corridor which allow views into the breakout room and also give each house a sense of place. As we move inside, you'll notice another open, flexible space that can be rearranged depending on what's happening that day. You'll also notice two smaller meeting rooms in each corner with windows looking back into the breakout room, along with a large meeting area in the middle. The final stop on our tour is one of the renovated science rooms. We reoriented the lab and classroom space toward the windows to allow light to reach all the way into the room. Along with new cabinets, sinks, and cord reels on the lab side, the entire room will receive new paint, new flooring, new ceilings, and LED lighting. Thank you for joining us on this tour of some of the changes coming your way at Central Middle School.